got mail. Greetings, everybody, worldwide. Um, this is Austin Bullock. Um, today, as you all know, usually every week, weekly, I broadcast this uh, recap show called Recap of the Week with uh, Austin Bullock. But today, um, I'm going to be changing up the name and the show a little bit that we'll be recording weekly. And it's going to be called Austin Bullock's Mail. Now, this show basically is going to be upon me reading comments that people have left me during the past few weeks and uh, also counting on to the views and stuff like that. Now, we're going to go on with comments. The first comment we have for uh, Real Talk, episode number three on the TTC drivers, a YouTube user named Steve Pup. Let's read. First of all, it's called Toronto Transit Commission. You're retired. And there is schedules that tell you when the bus is coming. So you should educate yourself before uploading bullshit. Well, Steve Pup, I have to admit, if I wasn't broadcasting and you said that to me in front of my face, actually, in all fairness, I'd take a bottle and whack it off your face. Just being honest with you. But... Since I'm in a broadcast era, I have to give you respect for giving me that feedback. But at the same time, Steve Pup, if you're a TTC rider just like me, and a passenger that goes on the TTC almost every single day, weekly, you will know that the schedules are not always accurately right. Where they, the TTC drivers, will always come late, no matter if it's summer, spring, fall, or winter. So, Steve Pup, I'm just going to say one thing to you. Thank you for the comments, but I believe you should educate yourself before you start commenting bullshit onto my videos that you really are not educated to know about. Thanks. The next comment we have is from a guy named Mohammed Sharier. Man, you should stop these, uh, I mean, you should stop this YouTube shit, man, because nobody even watches them. My God, Mohammed. You really have a big mindset, don't ya? You really think no one watches my videos? Well, maybe you should go on to the videos, look on my channel, look on my videos, and you'll see there's up to 26 views, 37 views, you know, stuff like that. I mean, if no one watches them, then what are the 37 views for? What are those, puppets watching my shows? Oh, come on. You know, there may not be people liking my videos right now or commenting on them besides these four, but it will come in the future and it takes time, takes blood, sweat, and tears. Now, um, I thank uh, Muhammad for that comment because that's good feedback for me also. It gives me a good motivation. The next comment we have is from my, uh, my cousin's girlfriend named Jessica Major Fletcher. That is the saddest thing I have ever seen on how that little boy got treated. That is a terrible scene. Indeedly, it is a terrible scene. I mean, when I uploaded that uh, Real Talk number 7 yesterday, I mean, it was pretty sad, yeah, having to see the, some of those abuse clips, having to realize and show a description on how people are getting abused weekly like that. You know, there's a lot of people in this lifetime that may believe that they have the worst life ever, but at the same time, people, consider yourself lucky where there's much people out there that have a worse life than you have. Now, to the last comment we have for the day. Last comment from a guy named Jonathan Badisi. Nice video, really great points about abusers. Well, Jonathan, I thank you for that comment. I appreciate uh, you really realized I had good points in that video and you knew I wasn't doing it out of meanness. I really thank you again. Um, and uh, now we're gonna be going on to about my topics. When I'm doing real talk, I know everybody notices I do a lot of swearing. I do a lot of yelling, trash talk. But people, what you don't realize is when I do it like that, you know, I only do it to the people, everybody out there to listen. Because if I don't do it like that, 
some people might just go out and think that's right, and they will take that bad influence and they'll use it and get themselves hurt into the future. You know, and also, and I'm talking to the abusers out there that are doing it also. You know, give them the chance to realize what they're doing to their to their family members. Realize what they're doing to people out there that don't deserve it. You know, you have to, sometimes you can't just be nice all the time. Sometimes you have to get bad. Sometimes you have to show tough love in order to bring out the word that has to be said out into this world. I know it's a tough thing, but that's how real talk is. And by the means of real talk, it means we are telling the truth and the truth has been said. That's all I do it for, guys. And uh, I hope that that does teach everybody a lesson for the last seven episodes I've ever had to do. Now, to the last thing. To the viewers all around the world. <clears throat> this is my favorite part of the topic. I looked last night in my YouTube views. And uh, there was approximately um, a lot of views. Now, I'm going to read you all the views. Total views we have for the channel, 149 views. Monetizable views, 69. Estimated minutes that are watched weekly of my videos, 364. Now we click into the worldwide views. In Canada, we have uh, 129 people watching daily. Monetizable views, 64. Estimated minutes Canadians watch, 332 minutes. That's good for my country. I love my country. Thank you for being supportive. The United States, seven people watch daily. Germany, two people have been watched daily, and there's one monetizable view. The United Kingdom, two people watch, and one minute usually they watch. India, there's two people that watch, and there's one monetizable view, and they watch at least 13 minutes. So to the two people in India, thank you also for your great support. Thank you. South Korea, one person watches and has one monetizable view. In Spain, one person, one monetizable view. So in all the total views that we have from all of this together I added up last night, it's a total of 570 views. So honestly, I thank everybody these, these past couple of weeks that have been watching my channel, that have been tuning in, that have been doing absolutely everything. I really thank everybody that has been tuning in. You know, and uh, even to the ones who've given me the bad comments, I say thanks to that because definitely you guys are giving me the motivation to do better shows and I, it amuses me to have clowns com give me bad comments. Now, that's uh, pretty much it for today. So thank you all very much for joining me for Austin's mail and uh, please tune in every single Thursday for this episode okay thank you all have a great day and a great weekend and please dress up warm out there okay thank you bye bye everybody